Guess what time it is. It's time to open up three Crown Zenith Elite Trainer Boxes. Thanks for picking my channel. Um, my name's J Dub, and uh, this is the beginning of a big adventure with you and me. Um, I'm hoping that uh, we can pull some great stuff out of these three Crown Zenith Elite Trainer Boxes, and uh, hopefully we can trade them away to get some Wizards of the Coast cards and maybe keep a few for a you know, personal collection. They might end up on that frame at the top there. Who knows? <laughs> Stay tuned. Alrighty, let's get started. I probably should have opened these before the uh, camera started rolling, but you know what? I'll probably fast forward through this so you might not see it. I'm really hoping to get a uh, the Mewtwo uh, V-Star. That would be amazing. Um, so we'll go ahead and we'll go right into these. So this is going to be the first Elite Trainer box. Let me go ahead and open up the next one here. Give me a second. Don't take me that long. Right, maybe, maybe it will take me a little bit. <laughs> Alrighty. Here's another 10. And here's the last 10. You know, one of these days we'll figure out how to open these a little quicker. <laughs> so my biggest thing is I love Wizards of the Coast cards. Um, I'm hoping that we can pull some stuff to flip. Um, there's a couple cards I'll keep for myself. Um, but other than that, I'm really hoping that we can pull the um, that Mewtwo uh, alternate artwork. That'd be amazing. So let's get started here. All right, I'm on the side here. I'm going to go ahead and get that open. Oh, I can't wait. I mean, this is this is an amazing set. I um, I looked at all the artwork beforehand, unfortunately, um, but the artwork's just amazing. It looks gorgeous, all the cards in there. Oh, here's that code card for you guys. One, two, three, and four. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and get started here. Um, I'm hoping, like I said, I'm hoping we can pull something really nice. Um, any anything really that you know we can flip. Um, it's really hard to come by, uh, you know, find Wizards of the Coast cards when you go out to trade. Um, but I'm really hoping we can find some good stuff. There's a Reverse Hollow there. And it's a non-hollow Snorlax, so we'll go ahead and put that on the side and start opening up the next pack here. You know, you just really hope that you pull something. I mean, my luck with the modern sets, I haven't pulled, you know, the Lugia, I haven't pulled the, um, the Machamp, I opened two or three uh, booster boxes, and I haven't pulled the... Um, I didn't pull the Shining Fates Charizard once, but I did open up a lot to get that. Um, we did end up flipping that um, for a nice set of Wizards of the Coast. You might see that in a future video. I'll show you guys what I end up getting. Um, so let's go ahead and look through here, see if we get anything good. I'm hoping we'll see what happens here. And coughing and reverse rear and all right, that's a nice hit. We'll put that up on the easels in the back there. Um, friends in Hisui. That's 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 awesome. Look at look at the artwork on that card. How's the centering on that? Oh, not too bad. Right, we'll put that in the middle for now. Let's jump to the next card. No, I collecting Pokemon cards is a big investment. Um, but once you get you know once you're able to flip some cards. Eh, it's worth it. It's it's an enjoyable experience. You start cracking these packs and you start getting some good stuff. It's really worth it. Let me go ahead and get this open here. Alrighty. Go ahead and pull this out. Let me get that code card for you guys. Alright. This one we're going to just go right through, I think. Wulu, Ponyard, Snower. Oh, we got something in here. Okay. Shinx. And. Oh, we got the Mewtwo V Star, baby. This is, you know, this is, this is what I was looking for. 
Nice! That is an amazing card. That artwork on that card. Let me let me get this in a sleeve and a top loader before something happens to it. Oh god, I can't even put it in the sleeve now. Look at that card. That is an amazing card. Wow, look take a look at that, huh? Damn. Let's flip that over. Uh, center, centering's a little off, but at least it's clean. Damn, all right, you, you move over here. Let's get that in the top loader real quick. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Damn. Wow, we started. That was the third pack in? Yeah, third pack in. Like, get out of here, huh? <laughs> Damn. All right, I'll put that in there. All right, that's going to go right in the center there. Let's, let's keep going, though. We got a lot of packs to open. Uh, man, Pokemon. This set, this this is a beautiful set. I mean, compared to the other sets they had had, oh, this is a beautiful one. Go ahead and flip this up there. That's the uh, code card there. We're gonna kind of go through here and see what we end up getting. Snow Root and a Tangle Growth. Um, I, I think the biggest thing is finding a use for your bulk. Um, I'm gonna end up donating mine to a school once I get it all sorted together. Um, just because I, I don't think trying to sell it is, you know, worth your time or worth selling it to somebody else. Especially putting it in like a mystery box. I mean, that's not worth it. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at this one here. Go ahead and go through here. And we got a reverse there and nothing. Nothing in that one either. Well, I mean, I can't complain. We already got the Mewtwo in the back. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I didn't really, I didn't think this would start like this so early. I'm speechless, I really am. I mean, when I'm opening packs, I pull absolutely nothing most of the time. I'll be, I'll be completely honest. You get a couple rainbows here and there, but no big hitters. Here's that code card for you guys there. And then we'll go ahead and go through this. Ooh, there's something there. Okay, hold on. And, ah, this one. I just, I like the artwork on this. Very beautiful card. Let's go ahead and get that in the sleeve, why don't we? And uh, we'll get to the next pack here. Uh, this one won't go on an easel. I just don't think it's worth that much. Um, but yeah, I mean, the biggest thing, I mean, I'm just uh, pulling that. That was big. Still thinking about that. Well, let's get let's get another pull, huh? I'm thinking, uh, let's try and get a Gur uh, Giratina. That'd be amazing. Or a Palkia. The Arceus, actually. I, I think that, that one looks the best out of the four of them. I think the Arceus looks the best. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section which one you think looks the best. Let's go ahead and get to the uh, pack here. Now we got an energy. I mean, is that even going to be worth anything? You know, a hollow energy? And it's just the uh, Entei. I'm not even... I don't think that's worth anything. So we're just going to put that over there and... I mean, maybe later on I'll check it and see on uh, TCG. I'll, put the, I'll throw the price up if it is worth something. We'll throw it in the case and hopefully nothing happens to it. Um, but I mean, energy card hollow? Come on. You know, what are we doing? What are we doing here, Pokemon? And Lunatone and nothing in that one. And there's that code card for you guys there. Let's get to the next pack. How many have we opened? I, I, I haven't been keeping track. Hopefully you guys are, because I don't have a clue. I've lost count, and it's only been the beginning of the video, and we got a Mewtwo in the back. So we'll see. We'll see how far I get here. All righty. Oddish. And that's a reverse, and nothing in that one either. Wow. We were kind of like... We pulled the Mewtwo, and then it was like, you know what? You don't get any other cards. You only get the Mewtwo V-Star. But I mean, at least we pulled that. I mean, that's a big hitter. I mean, even if the price drops on it, that's a beautiful card. What do we got in this one? We got a coughing reverse. Oh no, there we go, a Mamphy. That's awesome. See, I, I love these character cards. I mean, they do a really good job on the artwork. Um, and they just look really nice. I, I love the hollow on there too. What's behind there? Yeah, let's go ahead and put this guy on the sleeve. I'll put it up on the stand because you know it's it's a it's a it's a nice card. 
that's a nice one. We'll put that one in. Oh, jeez. Jeez Louise. Let's go ahead and put that right up there. Awesome. All right, let's get these cards out of the way. The code card for that one is right there. And let's jump to the next one. Let me know what your favorite character uh, character card is. You know, um, I, I'm thinking my favorite is probably the Charizard from Brilliant Stars, but I haven't even seen that card. Uh, so just let me know in the comment section what you think is the best looking one. Let's go ahead and look through here. Ooh, what do we got here? Alright, the Mag Mortar. That's nice. You know, right by the, the uh, fireplace there, and behind it is a energy. I'm like, I, I don't get I don't get it. I don't, you know, make a hollow energy. What the what's the point of that? Uh, but yeah, let's get this guy in the sleeve. That's look at that artwork on that one. That's a beautiful card. We'll go ahead and take a you know more thorough look through these once the video is done. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and crack up crack open the next one here. And go through and nothing in that one, unfortunately. Kind of had a feeling after the couple uh, hits on the back-to-back -back packs. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and open this pack up. You know, oh jeez. You know, I always have problems opening these. I don't know if I'm the only one. And I've opened so many packs in my day. You can ask my credit card. <laughs> <laughs> I know, good ideas all around. And this pack is gonna have... Oh, Grant! That's a nice... He's picking an apple. I like that one. Look at the, uh, look at the hollow on that one. That's a nice card. Alright, and behind that is nothing. Okay, so let's go ahead and put that in the sleeve. And what a... That's a nice, that's a nice card. All right, let's jump on the next one here. We're, uh, I don't know, we might, nah, I don't think we're halfway yet. Maybe 15 packs in. We got one of the better pulls in the back there, which is exciting. A miscut card would be cool too. I pulled only one out of the, uh, out of the current cards. I traded it away for some Wizards of the Coast. You know, standard stuff for me at least. I don't know about you guys. And we have a Sun Kern Reverse and a non hollow That's not very exciting. Let's go ahead and jump to the next pack. We've got a lot of packs to go through here. Hopefully, you know, you're having a good time. I'm hoping you guys are getting the pulls as well. Um, I really do enjoy uh, opening Pokemon cards. I, a, lot of, a lot of the packs, you know, um, for the modern set, they've kind of lost value. Um, but I'm hoping that they'll regain it at some point. Um, we'll see. Fingers crossed. So let's go ahead and flip through this one. Ooh, the Dunsparce and a signature card. I don't think the signature cards are worth anything, so I'm going to go ahead and put that over here. But go ahead and take a look at that Dunsparce there. I love that. That looks great. That looks fantastic. Right up there on the, uh, on the bunk bed. That looks, uh, that looks good. That's a nice pull there. Alrighty, we'll go ahead and sleeve that bad boy up. We'll jump to the next card. Alrighty. Hoping we can pull another hitter here. Um, I'm hoping I, I, I need the Raikou. I opened two of these Elite Trainer boxes off screen and I pulled an Entei and a Suicune. So a Raikou would be amazing. That would be an amazing pull. So let's go ahead and see what happens in this one. Uh, we have the Wasp Vacuum, Rare, or no, that's a, what's that, Uncommon? Yeah, Uncommon, Reverse Solo. Put that over here. Let's jump to the next pack. Alrighty. And this one is going to have the Volcanion and a Blossom. We're, uh, ho hopefully we can turn our luck around. I mean, not pulling stuff for a while sucks. You like opening pack after pack and all you're getting is rares. Oh, it's rough. It really is. But I'm hoping you guys are getting what you're looking for. I mean, you know, buying the cards on eBay can be a bit much. And trading for them, um, as long as it's a fair trade, you know, it'll turn out for you. 
Um, but a lot of it has to do with, you know, negotiating. Really. Um, I, I usually give whoever I'm trading with a better deal than what I'm getting. Um, just because I'm looking for older cards. But, you know, at some point we'll change that up so we can get more content. Let's see. Oh, I can't get this pack to open. Ah, there we go. Now we got it open. So let's go ahead and take a look here. Let's see. Let's do the pack trick on this one. See if it gives us some good luck. So that's four from the back. Condition on the back looks pretty good. Oh, we got one of those V-Star markers. Let me know in the comment section what the what those are for. I you know I I don't have a clue. Um, so let's go ahead and go through here. Shaman, Crushing Hammer, Dusclops, Biduff, Potion, Mr. Mime, Sun Kern, a coughing, Snorlax Reverse, and a Whale Lord. All right, well, let's open up our next pack. Hopefully we can get something. You know. We've been, uh, our hits haven't been very good, these uh, three Elite Trainer boxes. Well, I mean, I guess I can't complain of a Mewtwo V-Star. Um, but I mean, you know, there's a, there's a lot of big cards in these packs, and not getting any of them kind of sucks. We haven't got a rating either. Um, actually, let me go, let me show you that code there so you guys can get your packs online. And let's go ahead and do four from the back. Oh, yeah, that's four from the back. Mm, it's got a little ding at the top there. Right, well, let's go through, you know, quality control. I mean, I guess you're mass producing it. It's kind of hard to keep track of it all. Ooh, nice little soul rock there. What's behind it? Oh, it's just an absolute. But the soul rock is nice. Look at that. I, I love the artwork on that. The hollow is nice. Let's go ahead and flip it over. Yeah, it's got a little whitening already on it. That's That sucks. You know, but yeah, it's it's a it's a hit. Better than what we've been getting. So maybe the next pack's the big hit. Uh, maybe a double banger, that'd be pretty sick. Let's just go ahead and take a look. Um, I really want a Raikou. If I could, if we could get a Raikou before we're done opening these uh, packs, that'd be perfect. Give me a Raikou. Let's go ahead and open these up. I opened two before. Um, before the you know the videos that we're recording right now, and I pulled uh, two Pikachu's, um, so I think the the you know getting that card's not super rare. Um, so I think the value is going to drop almost immediately on that one. Um, so if you can get a trade off, I think in the next couple days, I'd recommend it. So we got a Water Energy Shaman, Crushing Hammer, Carvana, Wulu, Shinx. Snow Run and ooh, all right. The artwork, on, all right. That is beautiful, beautiful. The Northern Light. Well, I don't know if it's Northern, but those lights at the top there. That is a gorgeous card. And behind it, uh, just uh, non hollow. But this, this is a beautiful card. I mean, uh, it's so, it's so hard to trade stuff for Wizards of, Wizards of the Coast when you pull these nice cards, because I mean like, some of them are really worth keeping, like that Mewtwo V-Star, we'll think about, you know, we'll fig well, I'll, I'll try and figure out what I want to do with it. Um, hopefully the centering is good and we can get it graded and do a grading video, um, but we'll see. We'll see how far along we get here. So we're going to do four from the back, we're going to go ahead and jump through here, another V-Star marker, Lunatone, Shinx. Oh, that reverse and nothing in that one. All righty. Let's go ahead and open up our next pack. I mean, uh, opening up packs, it's draining because, I mean, a lot of the time you're opening and you're not getting anything. But, I mean, a lot of the time, too, you're getting amazing stuff. So I can't complain. I really can't. One, two, three, and four. All righty. Let's go ahead and look through this. So we've got a Dark Energy, Soul Rock. Uh, I'm going to butcher that name. Crocker, Croc? Crocker Croc? I don't, know, I don't know. Go ahead and jump through that. And Sandal, Grumpin. Yeah. Oh, we got a Radiant. Oh, what's behind? Oh, no, no. But oh, what a nice Radiant. Eternus. Eternus. That is a nice Radiant card. See, the Radiant cards are fun. I mean, they're, they're nice. I, I've pulled a couple of 
them from the past sets because they've been doing it for what the last two or three sets uh, the alakazam from lost origins that's a nice one i'd like to get that one gem mint 10 at some point the ones i've pulled i don't think have been centered enough which kind of sucks um but i mean like you do what you can do you know you keep uh, opening packs or you trade for them you know do what you can do at the end of the day so let's go ahead and open this pack up here we're almost done we only got uh is that six left yeah six left so ho hopefully we can get some big hits Ooh, i see something already all righty all right let's do the pack trick on that one one two three and four the back looks good on that so let's go ahead and do this kind of slow and uh, methodical here so we got a psychic energy a rare candy a Laron. Friends in Sinnoh, Ponard, Tangela, oh, no, we don't want to see it yet, Ball Toy, uh, Galarian Meowth, Whalemore, Wilmer, Tapu Lili, and, oh, it's just a V, Hatterene V. That's not very exciting. <laughs> Damn, I got all excited for nothing. Well, we'll put it, we'll sleeve it up and we'll put it over there. Let's see what's next. I, I still can't believe the fourth, third pack in we pulled the Mewtwo. Jeez. That's unbelievable. It really is. Alrighty, let's go ahead and open up some more stuff here. Ball toy? Oh, we got we got something here. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me go ahead and show you guys that uh, code there. One, two, three, and four. We got something here, something here. Alrighty, Steel Energy, Soul Rock, Rare Candy, Luxio, Ball Toy, Shinx, Meowth. It's almost like the same pack. Energy Retrieval, Larvesta. Oh, and a Melanie. No, oh, there's something behind it. Hold up, hold up, hold up. There's something behind it. And behind it is. Alright, not. Not that exciting. Azura V Max. Um, but still, I mean, double banger pack. I'll take it. I'll take it. Let's go ahead and get this in the sleeve. And let's go ahead and get this one in the sleeve. Oh, Jesus. All right. Go ahead and pop that in there. And let's go to the next pack. All righty. Well, that wasn't too bad. opening these packs sometimes. Yeah, I think he's pretty strong glue for this, this print run. I remember, uh, I think it was Brilliant, no it wasn't Brilliant, I think it was Vivid Voltage, the reprint of Vivid Voltage. The packs were really loose and you could like, almost like, push the cards out of the pack. Right, let's go ahead and jump through this one. Here's your code card there. Good luck on that. And on this one, ooh, Magnazone, alternate artwork, and another one of those signature cards. Again, I, I don't think these are worth anything, but eh, maybe to the right collector. I might end up going back and sleeving them. We'll, we'll see. I don't know. Maybe put them in my trade binder and you'll see them get traded to somebody. Somebody doing a master set of this. You know, who knows? Um, we're down to the last four here. Last four. Hopefully we can get something big. Big hit. Giratina would be nice, um, Alkia, Dialga, um, Ar the Arceus card's amazing. Again, like I said, a Raikou would just be, a, a, you know, exactly what I'm looking for. So let's go ahead and jump through this one. Oh, there's nothing to do for Well, that one was a little bit of a disappointment, but we'll just keep trucking through here. Do what we can, right? All right, last three. Last three. Go ahead and jump through here. And this is your code card there. And, oh, oh, it's another one of the, why? Oh, you know, a holographic energy. I don't know why you would do that. You know, as a, as a you know, inside the pack. But yeah, that's what we got there. Again, I don't think that's worth anything, but I'll go back and sleeve it if I have to. All right, second to last pack here. Again, the big hit was that Mewtwo at the beginning of the video. Um, let's go ahead and jump through here. 
So there's that code card for you guys there. And let's go ahead and jump through here and switch and a Tangled Growth. All right, last pack. I'm not going to say last pack magic because then you probably jinx it. So let's just uh, let's just say last pack and uh, hope for the best. I mean, we already kind of got, I wouldn't say the best card, but one of the best cards in the set. But it, hopefully, hopefully, this can be a big hitter. So let's go ahead and jump through here. Let's do the, the pack trick for this one. Here's your code on that one. One, two, three, and four. And let's go ahead and jump through here. Water energy. And that thing, we got a Great Ball, Bisharp, Tangela, Pancham, a Bell Toy. I don't know why it's going out of focus for you guys. Meowth, Whalmer. Ooh, Dust Skull. All right, what's behind the Dust Skull? We got a Taurus. But at least we ended off with a, you know, a decent hit. Nice little character card there. Well, it's a Galarian uh, artwork card, I think. I don't remember the exact term for it. Uh, but yeah, I mean, it looks nice. I won't hold it against them. That's a nice hit there. Oh, but that Mewtwo. Let's go ahead and take one last look at that Mewtwo. That's a beautiful card. Beautiful card. Centering's a little little off. I might I might go get it graded anyways. Um, but the centering's a little off, so who knows? Who knows what that will come back. Um, thank you for watching the video. Um, and hopefully we can keep opening packs together. And um, thank you again. Bye.